This is part two of me DIYing my guest bathroom. In the first part, I finished the vanity and now I'm going to do the floor. I'm going to be using an X-Acto knife and this peel and stick vinyl flooring. These tiles came as 12 by 12 squares, but I'm cutting them to be four by 12 rectangles instead. I went ahead and cut the entire box of tiles to be this size and then I laid them out on the floor and I'm going to do a herringbone pattern. This tile is really simple to use. All you do is peel the paper off of the back and the tile is really sticky and sticks right to your floor. I went ahead and laid all the tiles down throughout the entire bathroom and I did the same pattern throughout the entire floor. I made sure that each piece was spaced the exact same distance from the other pieces. If you wanted, you could use spacers, but I decided not to. I used an X-Acto knife to cut the weird pieces and the ones around the corners and I found that this tile was really easy to cut. After all of the floor was laid, I let this sit for 24 hours before I grouted it. I bought a light gray colored grout and I mixed it according to the instructions and then I started applying it to the floor. I worked in really small sections at a time and I used my flow to spread all of the grout throughout the floor. After it sat for enough time, I went through with a wet sponge, wiped it down, and then I did the next section. I went ahead and repeated this process to the entire floor until everything was grouted and then after it sat for about 24 hours I went through with a damp cloth and wiped it again. This entire flooring project was so simple and inexpensive and I can't believe how good it looks. This entire project cost about $40 to complete. 